The Dynadash series have been around since 2004. Play first of the developers and publishers of this game. Its platforms include iOS, Microsoft Windows, Mobile, Android, and plenty more. Other games that Playfest have developed include Wedding Dash, Cooking Dash, Tasty Planet, and countless more. This game is crafted by PG. Its challenge lies in time management. It is a strategy and time management video game. Flo is a hard worker at a big stock market company in Dynatown. She quits her job wishing she could work elsewhere. She finds a run down old diner and purchases without hesitation. She has to earn enough money to repair it. She reopens a restaurant titled Flo's Picky Palace. Gradually, she opens better nights. The point of the game is to travel along with Flo in her journey as a speedy, heroic restaurant owner. You have to keep the customers content and cater. You also have to maintain your customers' happiness by serving them quickly and offering them drinks to refill hearts. Each customer has an individual personality, making it challenging and intriguing. By earning a certain amount of points, you are able to pass levels and increase the intensity. The game gradually becomes more difficult by adding more customers with more demands. The gameplay involves seating customers and guiding Flo around the restaurant to serve the customers. If enough money is earned after each level, the player proceeds to the next level. As the game continues, Flo updates the rundown restaurant, allowing you to choose decorations, flooring, counters and much more, which engages the player and enables them to connect with the game. Flo also builds three further restaurants, each providing new settings. The gameplay focuses around catering customers to earn as much money as possible. Flo can be moved around the restaurant to complete tasks and earn money. As customers arrive at the restaurant, the player has to drag and drop them to be to a table. Once they are seated, they then observe the menu. The player must then guide Flo to the table to take their order, which is then taken to the service hatch. After the chef has prepared the meal, Flo has to deliver the food to the customers. When the customers are finished eating, they must be given a check, and at this point, customers are able to leave a tip. They leave their dishes on the table and depart the restaurant. Flo must clear the dishes before the next set of customers can be seated at the table. Customers have a series of hearts over their heads that indicate their mood and patience. The longer the customer has to wait, the more hearts he or she loses. Each type of customer has different degrees of patience and tipping habits. Flo can also perform various actions such as talking and interacting with customers and serving them drinks. By completing these actions, you are able to receive hearts. When customers lose all their hearts, they exit the restaurant, costing the player points. The goal of each level is to earn a certain amount of points. You can buy a number of appliances with the money you earn throughout the game to make things easier for you, such as coffee machines and many more. Expert, expert points are available for advanced players to achieve. There are two modes in the game, career mode, which follows the story of Flo, an endless shift mode, which the player must last as long as possible in a single level. Each level has a different level layout. Customers. There are a range of different customers. Young lady, which has a moderate speed, patience, tip, and she is the most common customer. Food critic. She is impatient and slow to order, eats at a moderate speed, gives a star when leaves if happy. Senior. Most patient, slow to eat and order, doesn't tip well. Businesswoman, impatient in line and at a table. High tipper and eats and orders at a fast speed. College kid, impatient in line, patient at a table. Mr. Hotshot, they are impatient in line and at a table. Each customer has different needs. Some may even dine and dash if their needs are not attended to. Bonus points are earned when customers are seated in a seat with colours matching their outfit. You can earn more points by completing chain tasks. Taking three orders in a row gives you more points than simply taking a single customer's order at a time. I rate this game 7 out of 10 dishes.